Hunter, Clint Capello, and Danilo Gallinari. Kalena's buddy for Atlanta, the starters. And Herter for three, third best three point shooting team in the NBA. And it'll be interesting is how he plays with Clay and Wiggins to begin. And you want to keep moving if he gets the ball in the post. And then rebounding will be an issue with Capella as he gets the Gallinari miss three. Wiggins opens on Trey Young. Trey Young's step back is perfect. They run a lot of different types of pick and rolls. Green, know what the defensive game plan is on those. Clay Thompson, a good look. And he was already running back. I like that Wiggins Thompson. And he figured if he just shot it when he did, that would be his best opening. He was right. DeAndre Hunter, well defended, but a better shot. And the same kind of thing, though. He would. Atlanta is bottom five defensively, but they're an elite offensive team. The hook pass all the way out to Herter. His three on the way is good. I think Trey Young is threatening. The defense collapses. He gets the ball moving. Jordan Poole with a triple in response. Yeah, the screener's defender just isn't close. Mega missing the three. Warriors have taken a lot of early threes here. Herter with the up and under. And the rebound battle. When you got Capella, you better get a body on him. He gets almost four off tournament spot, and they have a chance to get to ninth. But offensively, they're one of the best in the league, and they really take care of the ball. Clay Thompson missing there, but Draymond on the rebound. Clay on a reload three and drops it in. So Clay's hit two threes already. And good to see him line it up from the exact same spot. Chances are he's going to make one. Gallinari wants to post up Jordan. Make sure you don't want to foul Gallo. Gets it into Capella at point blank range. <laughs> I always think in between trying to make the skip pass and pass it to Capella. Good thing Capella kind of stole it. Kamega can drive on Gallinari. I mean, it, he scores right over him. Gallinari, as he's gotten over it a little bit, they need to attack that. And that was actually good defense from Gallinari, but acrobatic shot from Kamega. Now, this is what Gallinari can do well, though. He hits the three. And that's what happens when they get the drives. It sucks. They kick it back out to the shooters. That's why they're so good shooting the ball, because they get it inside first a lot of times. Raymond kind of directing traffic here. Setting up Jordan with the shot clock at 11. Wiggins post up. And Jordan Poole, he's been that hot. Launch it in. It's kind of surprising to me the way they're playing it. Gallinari, deep position. So Gallo early is rolling. So he gives them that. And the Warriors didn't have the advantage there. Clay Thompson and Capella met Kaminga up top. Nice defense. And Clay. They trade three for two. Instead of a Kaminga dunk, it's a Thompson three. That Clay's pass, though, to Kaminga. That was a good sign, too. Clay kept Trey Young in front of him. And now Young had to give it up. Kevin Herter from deep. He's got a great nickname. They call him Red Booth. Sometimes, all the time, it always looks good. Jordan Poole just attacking Trey Young. Trey Young work on this side. Capella on the roll, and they are late. They foul him, and he lays it up and in. Trey Young's instincts. And, and so that's the worst of every world because Trey Young got a layup off the jump ball. Those are the type of plays on the road. Those are the plays that get you beat. Andrew Wiggins for three. The Warriors have really started to pop. Jordan Poole, nice screen by Wiggins. And GP2, an acrobatic finish. The lit Trey Young. <laughs> Trey Young wanted to travel. Trail pool three is perfect, and he was fouled. You got to thank GP2 for making that play. The teams in the league, sometimes they can struggle in transition. If you're going to run for teams, but he's a really good player. He can handle the ball and pick and roll, can shoot it. I love where Poole just delivered that to Peyton perfectly. It's other people involved, and he's just going to read the defense, take what the defense gives him. Sometimes that's the pass. Damian Lee who had that incredible game in Miami. Getting some first quarter run here. Looney with the shot clock at 10. 
Damian Lee slicing without the ball, just like he did against the Heat to lay it up and in. He knew he was, he reads the play. He's coming at full speed. That's why that play works. I just love that he's thinking about getting inside, breaking the paint. And he's a good three-point shooter, too. So that was oh, set up as Gallinari. Yeah, Gallinari. He picks up in. the foul. Able to step through and then draw the foul. He's one of the really good players in the league when it comes to drawing. Nate McMillan's old school. He's got a guy that's rolling. He's going to go right back to him. And Gallo hitting the fadeaway. He's feeling good. Damian Lee got hit in the fit. Is scuffling, getting into the front court here. Gordon Poole wing jumper, and he's fouled again. <laughs> the Warriors got a guy that's rolling. He's been rolling. D. Lee is talking to Steve Kerr. He definitely got hit in the eye, and he's trying to just gather everything right now. Is Atlanta uncomfortable? Well, that's the thing with, with Jordan Poole guarding the screener. You can just switch that one. He just switched it so hard. Oh, no. In and out of the hands of Clay, and the Warriors are giveaway. Damian Lee saved the day. It was a lazy pass. It was behind him. Final two minutes of this first quarter. You like offense, this has been your night. Clay Thompson missed that three and hit three threes in the quarter. Yeah, they're setting that high screen to get Peyton off of Trey Young. Clay takes a turn now. Deep two, and he got it. That's good defense from Clay. You just tip your hat and run back. He's got that kind of talent. Otto Porter and Draymond. Draymond's directing traffic, and I love when guys...